this was our last day on the river. Tomorrow we flew uh, back to Cairo. Uh, and it kind of seemed like they were saving the pyramids and the Sphinx for last. And, and we were certainly not disappointed. But we were also not disappointed with our days on the river. The cruise was just fantastic. The Temple of Esna. <laughs> This is a Roman temple. Very colorful capitals on top of the pillars. The frieze at the top of this wall is filled with cartouches with the names of the, uh, the pharaohs, not, actually not the pharaohs at this point, it's the uh, emperors. So yeah, we're headed downstream. So we uh, we lost about 27 feet in elevation, as you can see behind the doors to the lock. There uh, we were at the higher elevation. We went into the lock, and uh, they pumped out the water, and now we're equalized with the Nile downstream. So we're starting to pull out on the lock. The obelisk of Ramesses II. God's sacred, sacred Ben Ben, which is This is the pedestal of the obelisk that was given to the French people and now sits in the middle of Paris. This is the mosque of Abu al Haddad. This is the mosque that has been added to the temple. Well, I think this is the best statue of Ramesses II in existence. These cartouches along the bottom of Ramesses' throne each stand for cities that he has triumphed over. And you can see the rope between the necks of the uh, men representing the cities and their arms are tied behind them.
This is a Christian church that was built by the Romans within this temple that was originally built in the Middle Kingdom by the Egyptians. This is Alexander, and that is the cartouche of Alexander, right there above his forehead. A hastily snapped photo of sunset over the Nile.